Hey guys, welcome to this episode of Pittsburgh Bottom Feeders. Considering the weather is getting really cold and now it's winter time, we're going to go and teach you how to make an awesome bait that is great for carp fishing in the winter months, and that is a pack bait. If this is your first time tuning in this channel, Glad to have you, and if you want to learn to catch carp and catfish, consider subscribing and clicking that bell so you will be notified every time we upload a new video every week. Alright, now the three ingredients you're going to need to make this pack bait is very simple. is breadcrumbs, jello mix, and corn. Now when it comes to the breadcrumbs, make sure they're plain. These are the Japanese version. We really highly recommend using the panko breadcrumbs because those are the Japanese style of breadcrumbs but you could use just a traditional plain um, breadcrumbs but make sure they're plain not seasoned so we're going to go ahead and put all these ingredients together and make this awesome pack bait that works really good for carp fishing during the winter month now the first step is to take your breadcrumbs and dump it into your your bait bucket or, or a bowl to mix the ingredients. Next, just take your Jello mix. This is a uh, strawberry flavor. You can use whatever flavor you want: grape, cherry, orange, pineapple, banana, whatever flavor you prefer. Um, but we think the strawberry is one of the best flavors to use um, in this pack bait. Take a pack of Jell-O mix out. Dump the whole packet in there. Then take your hands. Mix it around to distribute the strawberry jelly mix all through the all the breadcrumbs. Make sure it's all mixed up in there really good. So it spreads the jelly mix all through the breadcrumbs, not just in one spot. Take the corn. Dump the entire can of corn in there. Mix it all up. It takes a few minutes to that breadcrumbs start to absorb all the liquid. Sometimes with this much, you have to use two cans of corn. I'm going to put a second can of corn in here to really. Get it mixed up in there. Let's put a second can of corn in here. Consider this is a big mix. Mix it all up in there. Make sure that I get it all. Mix it all up. And distribute all the corn. And all the flavoring all through the breadcrumbs and jello mix. As you can see, it's starting to, the breadcrumbs are starting to absorb all the liquid off the corn there. Now it's becoming more of like a pack bait. And what's so good about this pack bait is that it has a really nice slow breakdown, I mean a fast breakdown, and you got a nice big pile of this bait sitting on the bottom for the, for the carp to come by and get you into the carp it looks like it's about right now we're going to go ahead and take a bunch of this right now and make it a ball as you can see it just absorbs right into a nice pack bait there just like that and then you can feed you can get a method feeder or inline sinker and mold that right around that and that's it that 
is how you make this awesome pack bait for the winter months. It just breaks up real easily. Once it gets it out there, it just breaks up nicely. Like I said, right now it's still a little dry. Um, but once that, like like I said, once you let it sit for a while and let that the um, corn, uh, the breadcrumbs absorb all that liquid off the corn, you're in good shape. So hopefully you learned something in this video, and uh, you get uh, have some success in catching awesome carp using this bait. And as always, guys, have the fishing and tight lines. See you next week. Mm -hmm.